The linear variable repression transformer has three solenoidal coils placed end to end around a tube. The center coil is the primary, and the two outer coils are the top and bottom secondary. A cylindrical ferromagnetic core attached to the object whose position is to be measured slides along the axis of the tube. An AC current drives the primary and causes a voltage to be induced in each secondary proportional to the length of the core linking to the secondary. The frequency is usually in the range 1 to 10 kHz. As the core moves, the primary linkage to the two secondary cores changes and causes the induced voltage to change. The cores are connected so that the output voltage is different between the top secondary voltage and the bottom secondary voltage. When the core is in its central position, equidistance between the two secondaries, equal voltage are induced in the two secondary cores, but the two signals cancel, so the output voltage is theoretically zero. In practice, minor variations in the way in which the primary is coupled to each secondary means that a small voltage is output when the core is central. Thank you.